This is a video explanation of the partial sums algorithm that we use for solving addition problems with two or three digit numbers. The first thing that students need to be aware of when using this method is place value. So when looking at the number 458, the students need to be aware of that that number is made up of four hundreds or four hundred. It has five tens or fifty and then it has eight ones or eight. They would need to know the same thing for 352. Unlike in most traditional methods where you would start in the smallest place value spot, for partial sums we start in the largest place value, which here is the hundreds. So students would think of 400 plus 300, which is 700. Then they would go to this next smallest place value spot, which is the tens. So we would be thinking about what 50 plus 50 is, which is 100. And here the students need to keep all of their place values lined up. So the one needs to go in the hundreds place, keep everything lined up 100. And then we would move on to the ones so here they would look at what 8 plus 2 and 8 plus 2 is 10 so the 1 needs to go in the tens place and 0 and then students can solve from there so then they would go back to the ones column 0 plus 0 plus 0 and now it's a much easier addition problem to solve. 0 plus 0 plus 1 and 7 plus 1 is 8 for a final answer of 810.